Hey, girl. Hey, girl. I love you. I love you. I love you. I love that you're on Hit the Floor and it's coming back to BET. We are so excited. Thank you so much, BET, for bringing us back. I mean, we had three successful seasons on VH1 and we thought we were done. And all of a sudden, out of nowhere, swear to God, I have a story for you. Let me tell you. Yes. Okay. Okay. So I'm a really optimistic person. I mean, as you can tell, but I got pretty negative when we didn't hear anything about Hit the Floor. And this was last year. And I kid you not, I went into this macaroon shop and this girl's like, I'm so obsessed with you. I love your character. I love the show. When's it coming back? And usually I'm like, oh, we're waiting, but it's coming back. I said, it's not coming back. And I, the day after that, we found out on Hollywood Reporter, Deadline Hollywood, all these different venues that were coming back. I was like, why didn't I just do this earlier? I mean, <laughs> and our show creator said the same thing. It's like, why couldn't you just be negative Nancy before so we just come back sooner? I can't believe it. I'm so excited you guys are coming back. Because yeah. I was like, looking, I was like, why isn't it? What's going on? What's going on? I was like, VH1, you've made a mistake, but BET, yes, girl. Yes, girl. Thank you. I love that you just called BET a girl. BET, you a girl now. BET is a girl. Heck yeah, I'll take that. Always has been, always <laughs> will be. Always will be. <laughs> so tell me, what's going on with you this season? Oh my gosh, well, um, as you know, after the um, the summer special, Kyle becomes captain. Yelena gives her the position as captain, and now I'm boss lady. So that is a whole other ball game for me and for the character, Kyle. It's 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 a lot more work. It's a lot more uh, bossiness. <laughs> a lot more sass. If she can get any sassier. I love Kyle. I love the fact that she was just one of those girls that was always working at getting her business, getting her cheddar, getting Listen. her money. Getting them monies, getting them coins. Listen, I have learned a lot from Kyle. I have learned so much from this girl. I was like, can I do this to get what I want? <laughs> Sorry, mom and dad. <laughs> I mean, and there, obviously Kyle's going to bring back some more sex, you know, and probably some more sex. Um, <laughs> Sorry, dad, you can't watch that episode. <laughs> We should all be Kyle. You know what? I've had people come up to me and be like, I want to be you. I'm like, you want to be me or Kyle? I think everybody wants to be Kyle. Yes. Yeah, yeah. She's, fun. She's so fun. And, you know, I look forward to playing her. I look forward to reading the scripts. I look forward to dancing her. Because, you know, when I'm dancing as Catherine, Catherine Bayless, it's different than dancing as Kyle. I can be a little bit more extra, mm -hmm. I guess. <laughs> Kyle is extra. There so is. when you guys first auditioned for the role, what was that like? Did you bring a lot of yourself or did you just totally bring what you thought Kyle ended up being on the screen that we love? Well, there's a cool story about the whole audition process. So I came in and they, they said, do you dance? And I said, yes. Okay, great. If you get a call back, you bring the dance in. So I did. And I knew that Kyle was a stripper going to you know going to be a devil girl. So I made my little solo very slutty. <laughs> with, with with some technique cuz I'm 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 actually a true dancer. Um so then they I brought that in. They're like, "Okay, so you're coming back tomorrow. Could you bring the dance back a little less slutty?" And I was like, "Okay." And then they heard a little of my accent cuz I didn't go in with the accent. It didn't call it didn't, Kyle was not from the south. So James heard the accent and he goes, "Can you bring it back with with, you know, the Southern accent. I said, sure. And I did. And in the room the next day, um, I started doing it Southern with my voice and they all started busting out laughing. And the scene wasn't funny. You know what I mean? It just became funny. And the, and I, I literally stopped everybody in their tracks. I was like, hold on. In the middle of my scene, I said, hold on. Y'all got to stop laughing because I got to get through my scene. And they're like, what? So I guess... <laughs> Kyle was just in me, and I and, and it's funny though because there was another girl testing for the part, like mm -hmm. after eight callbacks, and I was like, oh, I was like, either they're gonna go that way, way that way, or they're gonna go the funny route, and and then they went with me, and I just I'm so grateful, and this is probably the most fun character I've ever played in my life. Like I I could play her till I'm in a wheelchair. <laughs> Kyle's a hoot, and it looks like Kyle might have a little competition with some of the new girls. Yes, yes. Tiana Taylor's um, here this year, Kendall Ferguson. And even though, you know, they're they're coming to cause some trouble, I think that Kyle knows how to, like, keep it together and keep the peace. Because Kyle's always in the middle, and it, which just works for me because I'm the middle child of my family. <laughs> so I'm always like, just keep the peace, people. Let's just be sweet. You know, world peace. <laughs> no world peace. No world peace. No, resist, no world peace. girl. Resist. <laughs> so what is it like going from VH1 to BET? Did they make it a little bit more racier? Do they do a little more skin? You know what? I'm glad you asked that. Yes. I feel like 
everything's basically the same, just amped up. I mean, the sex, the scandal, the intrigue, the the jaw dropping dances. I mean, the dancing this year is on a whole nother level. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, I've learned dance moves that I never thought in a million years that I could do. But thank God, the floor was really soft <laughs> when I did these death drops and the splits. I think I surprised our choreographer that one night. We were dancing at 3 a.m. outside in the freezing cold right before Christmas. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to give everybody a Christmas present. Because <laughs> they let us improv this one little number because we were doing like a battle. And I just went off. Hopefully they kept most of it because I, I just want to see it. Because I'm like, I worked hard on that. And I could have broken a neck on that move. Oh but I didn't. Do not. Now I heard you guys really like each other and that you all come together, watch the episode, and live tweet. Always. We've done this in season one, which was like five years ago. And we we usually go to a bar restaurant and we get there right before it airs on the East Coast. So we're live tweeting before anybody sees it. You know what I mean? And, um, oh, yeah, we're one big happy family. I mean, it can get a little cray-cray, <laughs> especially if the drinks are flowing. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you ever want to bring... Some fans. Are you what? Kidding me? I know, I know. We should. We just can't. We can't reveal where we always go because we don't. We, you know. I mean, we love our fans, but it would be too much. I, mean, I don't think everybody would fit in there. <laughs> it would be too much because you know I'd be there. I'd be like, hey, you happy come. hour. You coming? I'm inviting you. You're coming with us. <laughs> now I have one question. What do you do to get ready for the dance scenes? Do you guys have to do a lot of stretching? Are you guys doing Pilates? What's going on with that? Well, okay, so to get ready for the dance scenes or just get ready for the dancing for the show? Both. Both. Okay, so dancing for the show, we all start training um, months beforehand. Um, and they give us that notice. So they give us dances. We, we give us dance classes over the edge. I take ballet. I take jazz. I take hip-hop. Um, but on the side, I do Pilates. I run because you have to get that cardio in so you can actually do the dance 15,000 times. Seriously. It's l like not even joking. And then um, and yoga to keep us limber. But, but before the dancing, oh, my God, yes, I have to stretch majorly. I've hurt myself on the show. I hurt myself in the pilot. I pulled a hamstring. But... In my defense, we had to jump in the air in a split and land in the split 20,000 times. Oh, and that was like before I'd, because like, I took time off of dancing before I got the show. And then we had eight months to train between the pilot and the first season. And then now, I mean, I'm probably, uh, you know, this is probably the hardest dancing I've ever done in my life. So I know how to like make sure I don't go in and do it full out until I know how to do the move. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm like, um, can y'all teach me how to do that before I break my neck or break my ankle? Okay. I've tried to do a few of the video bits and dances, and I tried to do it with the show one time, and I was like, <laughs> yeah, I'm not, no. Honey, I know you got some moves. I just saw that. Okay. <laughs> Come on, devil girl. I think I'd look kind of cute in a devil girl yes, outfit. Would but a one piece and I need support for the twins. Oh, the twins, yes. We all need support for the twins. Um, some of us might have had the twins fall out in our first dance because they, they were new outfits because these are our new Devil Girl uniforms. I and <laughs> I don't think we, uh, we got them fitted right all the way for some of these moves. And so we had to like take a seven minute break to go sew our, the twins in. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> That Always is hilarious. check the twins, people. Always check the twins. Check the twins. I'm hoping that that will not end up in a blooper reel, but let's be honest, a lot of people would love that in the I, blooper well, reel. I'm sure. I'm sure. I <laughs> now, you guys are back together as a family. You have some new people. Who is your favorite friend on the floor? Uh, that is so mean. Oh, my gosh. Well... You know, like half the cast is new, so yes. some of my best friends are like Logan Browning and Taylor Page and some of the older cast. But this year, you know, it's, it's oh my God, why are you doing this to me? Well, I have to figure okay. out who your friend is. Okay, well, my family is. I, I love our new characters. I love Tiana. I love Kendall. This, this He's like a brother to me, McKinley. <laughs> Tiffany and I did a project together right before this, and so we, we became besties on that. And now she got the show, which I literally did cartwheels and round offs when I found oh out she God, got it. So awesome. So amazing. And then, of course, Brent is so lovable. And Jonathan is, is the crack up king. And Jody, I, I just love this, this mug, this she's face. And she's just, aren't they? And she's the most amazing soul, too. And then, of course, Court and Christian are the newbies. And they're like brothers now. I mean, the thing is, it's like we're just one big happy family. I, I know we keep on repeating that, but we really are. And I think it shows on screen. I was yes. telling somebody that earlier. I was like, even when people, like, hate each other mm -hmm. on the show, you can tell that we actually love each other. <laughs> 
I personally look at the cast and I think I would date any of them, so it would be a bad idea for me to accept this. Even me? <laughs> you make me think, you know, hey, I reevaluate my sexuality. <laughs> you are hilarious. Oh you are goodness. so fun. Now, in the seriousness, I'm trying to get fit and healthy again. You were saying that you do yoga, you do dance classes. Do you do weightlifting? I do a little weightlifting. I have a Pilates class that's um, um, co- a combination of like smaller weights mm-hmm. and along with the Pilates. Um, I'm, I'm not like a big machine person because um, I feel like yoga sometimes I could get the uh, like the arm strength through there and like with the small weights. And um, I'm a big runner, so I, I love to run. And I think it also helps me again with the cardio for the dancing. Like we just had a dance live the other day at the BT Experience. I know, I saw oh, you did! Ah, thank you. It was. Uh, it was hard. Like, you know what I mean? It's, it's not like we have, a, you know, oh, let's do another take. I messed that one up. No, no, no. Our choreographer was like, listen, the first minute of this dance is live. If you F up, <laughs> you may not have a job next year. And I didn't mess up, thank baby Jesus. But one of the other girls did, and I was following her. And I was like, but she recovered. But we are making so much fun of her because she's one of the OGs, too. And, like, <laughs> she would, like we even made a gif out of her mess up. <laughs> Oh my gosh, we're so annoying. mean. We're so mean. Yeah, but um, but in you know it's funny because we we dance so much on the show, and after the show, I'm like, I don't want to dance right now. I just want to like do my other stuff, like Pilates and running and yoga and but I love I love like ballet bar classes. I take this class called Rock and Model at Equinox. My friend teaches it, so mm-hmm. it's kind of like a burlesque yoga Pilates um, combination. Well, whatever you're doing, it looks fabulous. And this dress is so cute. Thank and the you. shoes, too. Thank Damn, girl. Thank you. Thank you so much. You look fly, too. We kind of match. We do kind of match. I know. Look at this. Black and white. Black and white memo today. Ebony and ivory. Oh, what, what, what? Do you sing? I do. Oh, my God. I knew what I could tell. I do. Yeah. I was, um, I was singing country for a while, and I had to, put it, had to put it away for a second because of the show, and I just got really busy. Um, but, yeah, I've been singing since I was a kid, and um, I've written probably 10 songs and recorded them in Nashville. Oh, my God. I love country. I grew up with yes. Garth Brooks. Yes. I love me my Dixie Chicks. Where? Uh, stagecoach. Oh, um, i yeah, I, I haven't seen him since I was probably like in eighth grade, and I was like, "Wow, this is why you are a star." You, you, and Trisha Yearwood got up there and sang with him. I, I can't believe they got married and they're happily married. They and like, are. And like, oh tell, my god! You can tell like love on stage goals. that they're just yeah, love goals exactly. I mean, I think there was some like you know scandal I'm before like, that, but I don't care. No, no, it was a long time ago. No, no, long, long time ago, long time ago, and I don't care anymore because they were fabulous. They were fab- They've always been fabulous. Ago. I remember seeing them do that duet when they were before and I was like hmm, there's a lot of sparks there. there's right. a lot was yeah like, yeah <laughs> he yeah he's kind of like my idol I even got um a vintage t-shirt and my friend like ripped it up and put beads on it and like it was oh yeah I went out there I was like I was like I'm gonna be a super fan oh my god so I know you probably didn't do it this season of hit the floor I think we should have a musical episode next season <gasps> um James I think oh, James. episode would be <laughs> so fun. Because if you can sing, yes. I'm sure a couple of other ones can sing. Tiana can sing. Jonathan can sing. Tiffany can sing. McKinley can sing. Oh, there's y'all a lot could, of singers. You all could write. Oh, my God. That episode. would be so That'd fun. That would be perfect for BET. Our idea. Yes, Make yes. it happen. Oh yes. My God. yes. Yes. Oh my God. And I'll give you credit. I'll give you credit. <laughs> now, everybody wants to follow you on social media so we can live tweet with you. How can we find you, girl? I am at Kat Bayless, K A T B A I L E S S, on Instagram and Twitter. Looks like I'll be following you and I'll be tweeting with you this July 10th on BET. And hopefully, I'll be seeing you at, you guys might come to Comic Con or something. Would that be awesome? <gasps> what? What? Really? Is this the first if time you I'm put? This? That rumor out, out there. Let's put it out there, you people. Just do like a drive-by, take the metro, and be dressed up in your double girl outfits. <laughs> what? What? Okay, I'll take that. So Comic Con, here we come. <laughs> On the floor. On I'll the talk floor. to you later. Thank oh you. My God, you're so sweet. Thank you. Yes. Musical episode. Yeah, that would be idea. so.